Traffic, and now it's time for your pinpoint weather and traffic together. TJ Del Santo is here to say good morning to all of you and to let us know another sort of chilly day in store for us today. Yeah, we're looking at uh, temperatures uh, pretty far below normal today, but we are going to be seeing milder temperatures work their way in. But there's a price, unfortunately, that we have to pay yeah. for that. Yeah, of course. It always is this time of year. Let's take a look at what's going on right now. Live City Cam picture showing the uh, quiet conditions, really good visibility. We do have some clouds overhead across parts of the area. Temperature right now of 14, but look at the wind chill factor. It feels like three degrees outside, courtesy of these winds from the north northwest at around eight miles an hour. Relative humidity fairly dry at 48 percent as dry air has worked its way into the area over the last uh, 12 hours or so. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. We've got two radar sweeps scanning our skies, looking for some rain or snow. We're not finding any. Just examine Block Island and we're not finding anything there. Ray and Tina Pawtucket, cold, breezy with a hazy moon overhead. Temperature currently at 11 degrees. Over there in Pawtucket, 12 in Smithfield, 14 Providence, 15 from New Bedford to Newport to Westerly this morning, 13 degrees over there in Taunton. Here are the weather headlines for today. Quiet weather for the next few days, although it's a little cold this morning, but we are looking at fairly quiet and dry weather right into Thursday. Then milder and wet, and then possibly a weekend mix ahead, something that we'll be monitoring very closely. Satellite radar picture showing these clouds working their way across our skies and the snow really not too far away. Look at this batch of snow just missing us. It'll continue to work its way on off to the south and notice how these clouds are working their way on off to the south as well. We'll see that drier air working its way through our uh, skies throughout the course of the morning. Actually, just some thin clouds overhead now. We'll have quite a bit of sunshine today as a result of this area of high pressure building into the northeast. It's going to be fairly cold today and uh, still a little chill in the air for Wednesday as well. We're looking at high pressure to control our weather for the next two days and we'll get lots of sunshine as a result. Tomorrow's temperatures will be a, a smidge warmer than today. Very cold uh, for the morning commute. Temperatures in the teens, with the skies clearing out in the afternoon. We'll find temperatures topping up at around 28 in Central Falls, 30 on the east side. Rumford, about 30 degrees. On over into the East Bay, upper 20s to around 30. 30 in Warwick, 29 degrees in Cranston. Along the South Shore, we're looking at high temperatures in the low 30s, 30 degrees in Coventry. Up in Northern Rhode Island, we'll find lots of sunshine. 29 in Barville, 30 in Situate, and over in southeastern Massachusetts, we're looking at temperatures in the upper 20s to lower 30s, about 31 degrees in Westport. Clear and cold this evening with temps in the 20s. Here's your seven-day future cast. Sunshine for Wednesday, 35, a little milder for Thursday. Friday, we're looking at some rain and temperatures around 44 degrees. That's the price we got to pay for some milder air in here. And there's that wintry mix for the second half of the upcoming weekend. Tony's got your updated future cast later today on Eyewitness News live at five. Now it's time to get an update on our morning commute.